on Savoia Creek in the Jemez Mountains of northern New Mexico. We're going to teach you today how to fish using a bubble. Now this is a fairly common traditional means of uh, fishing here in northern New Mexico or actually just about anywhere in the west. Uh, it allows you to fish using flies on a spin caster. Um, what, uh, what you do is, is the weight of the, of the water inside the bubble, and we filled it up halfway with water, allows you to cast your fly out onto a pond or a lake a fairly good distance. You can cover a lot of water just using your spin casting rod and uh, float that, uh, that fly either below the water or on top of the water. You can put a hopper behind the bubble and fish it on top using a fly floating to keep it floating or you can use uh, something like a woolly bugger or a pistol peat on a length of line below the bubble floating down in the water and we're just going to throw it through the water and hopefully you'll get a hit and catch a nice fish. So the first thing you have to do is fill the bubble up with water and there's a fat end and there's a skinny end on this, on this bubble. The fat end jams up into the bottom of the bubble and holds the water in there. There's also a hole that runs right through the middle of that post. That's where our fishing line is going to run through. That allows this bubble to slide up and down on the line. And then we're going to put a swivel behind the fat end and that's where we're going to hang the line that has a fly on it below it. So we're just going to run this fishing line through the bubble and we're going to run it from the skinny end to the fat end. That way every time we cast it, the weight of the water in the bubble will jam up against the fat end and keep it tight. We're just going to run it through that hole right there and run it out the other end. You can see it just slides up and down on the line. This allows us to cast it real easily. And we're going to take the other end of this line and we're going to put a swivel on here. Swivel allows us to attach a, another uh, piece of line with our fly on it to the bottom. But there's our, our swivel at the end of the fishing line. And what we're going to do is we're going to hook a fly to that. Now today we're using a pistol peat, double hackle peacock. You can see that it has a propeller on it. When it goes through the water, that propeller turns, it catches light, it creates flash, and the propeller also makes noise. All this does is attract the fish. You can also use any number of different kinds of flies below that. But you're going to tie a loop in the end of your fishing line that has the fly on it. And all we're going to do is, is just run that loop through the little hook here on the end of that swivel. And you're just going to close that up, and you're good to go. So when you're casting, it's pretty easy. It's just like, like anything else. You open up your gate. There's a little touch to it, but this will really take it out across the pond for you, and that's the beauty of using this bubble. It really gets it out there. And oh, oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. We got one on. There we go. Yeah, it's a good looking fish. Oh, that's a cutthroat. That's a pretty cutthroat. Let's get him over here so we can take a look at him. There we go. That's a good looking cut. Let's see if we can get him out of here. That's a good looking fish. That's a good looking fish.